Well, Hecky, uh, great win, great performance. You've got to be happy with, with the whole 90 minutes, but especially that second half, the way they came out and, and obviously got those two goals in the first 10 minutes. Yeah, the yeah, second half in particular were really strong, um, really aggressive and, and set off like a house on fire in, in terms of regaining the ball out of the pitch and creating chances from it. But yeah, as a whole, the, the, the whole game was positive. Coventry are a good side because they treat it as a, as a proper reserve team and the manager drops down first team players and it's great experience then for our lads to play against them so we know it was going to be a, a real competitive game and yeah the first half there was more good than bad um, but the little moments of us being naive and, and playing like a 23s team in, in the details of how we press or dealing with a, a longer pass uh, is what gave Coventry their chances so yeah really good game for us to learn from that but pleased with everything in general you know, like you said that's probably one of the tougher tests they'll have in this league this season against a side that do bring down a lot of first team players so does that make it particularly pleasing the way they rose to the challenge yeah and, and the second half so what we discussed at half time uh, the tactical elements and just the intensity of how we want to play um, is the most pleasing thing because they took it on themselves they drove it and, and they were the ones that I could hear them before the whistle at the start of the second half driving each other um, and they were really aggressive won the ball back a couple of times in the first two minutes and it seemed to, to keep driving them on then so yeah pleased overall but listen it, every single player performed because there were moments where Coventry produced real good quality and Jordan had to make two or three good saves as well so uh, everyone played the part uh, and my only criticism could be that we didn't score any more goals you know for the amount of chances that we had Yeah, is that the standard now that they've got to set themselves sort of for the rest uh, of the season moving forward I want to be better than that. The, the the moments that it's been a recurring theme theme this season with with lads stepping up, um, and it, it's a change. It's a different environment. We want it to be tougher, um, but there's still the generally the chances we're giving away are from things we're doing wrong in terms of the fundamentals. What we're saying is important to be a defender. Important when you're um, defending your half the pitch. Um, those messages will never change. Um, but we're still giving the chances away from those. So we'll, we'll change that, we'll improve that. But in terms of the, the work rate, the intensity and the, uh, the desire to excite, we used that word before the game, in possession of the ball. Be brave, risk possession, play forwards, be creative. In terms of that, I thought we were exceptional, yeah. So uh, that that is something we want to keep going. Yeah, like you said, it's a different team this season. There's a lot of lads gone on loan. There's some that have stepped up, players like Blaster, players like Kamal, Will Lankshire as well. How pleased have you been with how they've progressed into under-23s football? Yeah, definitely. It's, it is different, as we said. They, they did experience it last year, although Will's Knox is straight out of school. Um, so they know what we expect, but it, it is a different style of football. It is a different type of football. Um, the little slight details you get wrong against good players, we play against good players today, usually end up as a chance on your goal or, or at least an opportunity to create something. So, yeah, we've been pleased with them and pleased with how they're responding. Um, and we'll just keep pushing because our job, it's not, not necessarily winning games although that is nice it's to get them careers in the game so we'll not lay off them we'll not we'll not change our approach in, in that respect we'll just keep asking more of them and keep supporting them when they do have the tough times